in this video we will learn how to use the optical character recognition property inside the MATLAB. As in MATLAB there are hundreds of built-in or default functions through which we can do any sort of processing or any sort of analysis. So here we are just focusing on optical character recognition R which is also called as simply as OCR. So in the first line we can see that we have a command that is mread. This command is actually for to read an image but what, what but which image is needed to be read? It is actually the business card or PNG. This is a default image in the directory of MATLAB. If you don't want this image to be read, you can choose any other image and can put here the path and the name and the type of the image like uh, business card is the name and dot png is the type of the image so you can put your own image here but with the proper link name and then dot type like dot png dot bmp or dot jpj now mread is actually now reading this image and getting and extracting all sort of information and storing all these infos into the variable i so now all the image information is now stored inside the i variable in the second line we have the function that is the built-in function of OCR which MATLAB is offering so OCR of I simply means that I is actually the image and OCR function is being performed on this image I and all the results will be stored inside the variable results then in the third line there is a command that is m show or you can say that image show command within the brackets it is the same image which is mentioned above m show just show or display this image so we can see that what sort of data is available on that image like uh, you can copy this that is m show control c and in command window paste it with control v and enter it yeah this is actually the image on which you can see a lot of characters and strings then we will come towards the for loop the line number four what it is saying for n is equal to 1 colon 10 means n is a variable and it is going from 1 to 10 but in first iteration it is n is equal to 1 then control will come on the line number 5 so where there is n actually there is 1 now so results dot words of 1 is actually giving us the first string within the image and it will be stored inside the word variable then there is a pause of 0.1 means there is a pause of or delay of, of 10 milliseconds and then again the for loop is repeated from n is equal to 2 then n is equal to 3 and so on up to the highest value 10 so in order to see the results we have to run this so you can press this play or run button 
and you can see all the words recognized that is netic that is drive l apple three and inc also the metrics so you can see that all the words are string are recognized you can also use this feature with any cam so it's enough for today